What's up guys, good morning. We are in the car heading to Heathrow Terminal 2 because today we're gonna to be heading to Singapore. We've got a 13 hour flight ahead of us. Ooh, sun is shining today. Um, yeah, we've got a 13 hour flight ahead of us with Singapore Airlines. We're gonna be traveling in style, which is very, very nice. But I'm super hyped about going to Singapore because we're gonna be exploring some of the most futuristic um, and some of the coolest places I think I've ever seen. But we're going to be going to the Cloud Forest Gardens, the Marina Bay Street Circuit Grand Prix, which is going to be insane. And I guess that that's kind of like the main reason why we're going to Singapore for the Grand Prix. We're also going to be visiting Gardens by the Bay, which is another like massive tourist attraction. Uh, so I'm sure many of you will recognize if you've not been already. Uh, by the way, I'm also vlogging on a brand new Canon G7X Mark III. So you might notice we're looking a little bit different out here today. There is a few issues with the focusing, so please bear with me whilst I get used to it. I think there's a software update that is on its way, which means that hopefully the focus on this camera will get better. So if I go out of focus and I don't come back in focus, I do apologize, but I'm trying to look at you and not look at the screen. <laughs> so yeah, we're gonna head to the airport now and I'll catch you guys when we're in Singapore. What's up everyone? So we've touched down in Singapore and first things first, it is so humid here. Like we walked through their aircon to airport. It just felt very relaxed and chilled. As soon as those doors opened, it was like <laughs> Absolutely fantastic flight. The flight attendants on board were so good to me. They had a nice Johnny Walker blue label, which was very delicious, wasn't it? It's lovely. And we're just about to head now to Oasia Hotel, which is in downtown. Also, we've um, been told that because of the fire that's going on in Malaysia at the moment, in the forests, uh, it's very hazy here at the moment. So, yeah, we'll have to see how much sightseeing we're going to be able to do because it does look extremely hazy right now. So we just come back to the hotel, got our head down for about an hour and a half, which I think is gonna feel amazing, but right now it feels like I've kind of been hit by a brick wall. But I thought I'd quickly share with you my outfit. I've gone all black. I've got some Condi Garcon sneakers on. Uh, these are some Dior trousers, River Island black t-shirt. Uh, and then I've got some Crafted London, Serge Denim jewelry on. I'm all blacked out, ready to head down and explore Little India and then Chinatown. So let's do this. So we've just arrived at Little India. Look how decorated those streets are. We're going to the banana leaf tree restaurant where they actually serve food on banana leaf. Apparently it's an old tradition that's been running for many years. And I've also been told that the food is absolutely incredible. So I think we're in for a treat. The banana leaf Apollo. We decided to go for a chicken curry. Of course the rice come in on the leaf. It's been served up, banana leaf dish. Got a couple of poppadoms, some dips to start. Uh, no, thank you. Yeah, white rice, please. Thank you. ready to dock the boat. The largest Gucci store I've ever seen. Chanel opposite. Got the orders down to the left. Wow, look at this place. So I don't know if you can hear in the distance, but you can hear the Formula One cars doing their test runs today. Here they come. Yes. 
Oh yes. Back to board, head into the Singapore suite. If you look just there, that is the sun trying to burst through the clouds. That's how much haze is around at the moment. It's so sad to know that that's been caused from the fires in Malaysia. We're just about to board the boat, not sure which one. Is it any, any boat? Amazing, we're going on. see how we get on and what we do for the rest of our time. So let's go. Right, we've just arrived and we're just about to walk into the main area where the larger structures are at Gardens by the Bay. It looks insane. What do you reckon? This way? Oh my god. They look ridiculous, don't they? Gee! Right, so we're going to go and head and try to find a nice viewpoint where we can get all of these in and me in a photo. So yeah, we're going to do a little bit of exploring. We're also going to be going onto the skywalk that you can see just running across at the top. And then I've just found out we've also got media passes to the two domes. So one is a botanical gardens um, and the other one is the cloud forest. So we're going to be doing that now and I'll catch you at the end of the day. Everyone, it's your boy AG right here. Please, please, please. 
<laughs> we have just got back to the hotel after a very long but very fun day. We managed to explore the Cloud Forest as well as the Gardens by the Bay and it's just incredible. Like the Gardens by the Bay are solar powered run. Um, they're huge but it also makes you realise how big the building is that we're going to be going to this evening which I don't know the name of but I know that the bar restaurant tea place that we're going to be going is called Sailor V. Do you know what it's called? So that's Sailor V and that's on, is it the Marina Bay? Is it the Marina Bay Hotel? Mm. Right. No, so, I think it's the Marina Bay Hotel. Obviously. I think the building is the Marina Bay Hotel. It's the three pillared with the no, boat it's on top. Marina Bay Sands. Okay. Okay. So we'll get there in the end. It's the Marina Bay Sands building where we're going to be going to Sailor V this evening. And the structures today at the gardens by the bay were massive and it, they look tiny in comparison. Anyway, I've gone off piste. That was a very fun day exploring. Um, if you ever do come to Singapore and you want to visit, everything's so close together. And going to visit the Gardens by the Bay and the Dome kind of come all in one package. Um, I think if you're gonna do that, do all of it because it's really good fun, it's a really good day. And it's actually really cool inside the Dome. It's really, really humid out and about. So it's actually quite refreshing to go in there and have a look around in a controlled climate environment. So very, very good fun. We're gonna get showered now, changed into a different outfit ready for this evening. So yeah, I thought I'd quickly check in, let you know how much fun we've had. And I hope you enjoyed the little B-roll section that I've just put together. And I'll be seeing you before we go out tonight. Just arrived to dinner. Got a couple of McLarens out the front, rangy. We're having food at the Fullerton Bay Hotel. We're actually on carpet. I feel at home. Good evening. This is when the decisions get really hard. Time to hit that sweet tooth. Ooh. So we've just come to Sailor V and the rooftop viewpoint is closed. So I decided that we're gonna stick the camera equipment away because we're gonna enter the club and there's not much to see in there, it's very dark. We're gonna enjoy a few drinks. James put the camera equipment behind me and then we're gonna call it an evening. So I thought I'd quickly check in, let you know what the situation was. Uh, but we had a lovely dinner this evening at the restaurant. We're gonna head back probably in about an hour or so, get our heads down, ready for another day tomorrow. So I'll see you guys in the morning. Good morning, everybody. So last night we finished off at around about midnight and then we came back to the room uh, and we cracked on with a little bit of editing and we didn't finish until about 4 a.m. So we've had a little bit of a leisurely start today, went down and had some breakfast, um, finished off doing a little bit of work in the room. We're now just about to head out for our third day uh, of exploring. Today we're gonna be going around the Marina Bay area. Uh, we're gonna be visiting the Malayan statue where the water comes out of the mouth. Um, it's quite an iconic thing to visit here in Singapore. We're also gonna be visiting the Louis Vuitton building by the shopping mall because it's just like insane architecture. Um, I think it actually featured earlier on in this video as I walked out of the door. So we're gonna go back to there. We're heading to that area um, and then we're gonna grab a little bit of food before the main event this evening, which is at the Grand Prix. At the moment, I think Leclerc is in pole position, Hamilton in second and Vettel in third. So I think it's gonna be a very interesting race. Um, hopefully we get some good viewing and our cab is here. So we're gonna go and check out the bay. Oh, it's bright out here today. So we have just visited the Louis Vuitton store, which is right behind me. I love the design and architecture of that. And uh, we've just exited from the mall, which is lovely and cool and air-conned. It's probably one of the biggest and high-end luxury shopping centers I think I've ever seen. There's every shop you could ever want and imagine for in there, so that's great. Uh, but we're just about to head over to Helix Bridge and then we're gonna go to Malayan. It's just over the bay. I'm gonna show you now so you can see it in full swing. Just here. So yeah, we're gonna go there now. 
do the classic shot. <laughs> that I've been wanting to do since the moment I knew I was coming to Singapore. And uh, yeah, and then we're gonna try and get out of this heat and get some food. Quick update, we went to walk across the Helix Bridge and they're actually using it at the moment as an access point to the grandstand for the Formula One that's happening this evening. Uh, so we weren't actually able to get across nor were able to do photos or video content or anything. So it's a little bit of a shame. However, we're now in a cab heading over to Malayan where we're going to be doing that shot I keep on telling you guys about. It better be really good. <laughs> Imagine if we get there and there's no access. <laughs> you can see the roads are really busy today, obviously because of the Grand Prix. Police escorts everywhere. Lots of cones. <laughs> so this is Merlion Junior. Let's go and see Senior. Oh, it's rocking out here, James. Oh, here she is. She's big. That's what I'm talking about. It's very busy down here though, guys. <laughs> I don't know how we're gonna get this photo. <laughs> yeah, boy. This is the other version, guys. This is the catch the water version. Couple of cheekers catching the water. Come on, I want someone else to do the mouth. There's two types of people in this world. People that play it safe. These people catch the water. And then there's people that have no shame. This geezer right here is the one that has no shame. Fine, he's going in. Tilt it back, baby. There he is. Just come back to the hotel room. That was hilarious. Probably one of the more awkward social situations I've been in. It is a little bit weird when you just stand there like... <laughs> for a good five minutes and James was uh, trying to explain to me that I needed to tilt my head further back so the water was kind of coming like into my forehead as opposed to into my mouth so I was literally standing in front of about a hundred people with my mouth like this and left a bit right forward back <laughs> it was jokes but anyway if you do come to Singapore it's a must must do and um, I'm glad I got the boomerang in fact I'm gonna show you the boomerang a little winky. So all of that was for this very special moment. If we can ever get a focus on this camera. There it is. <laughs> I actually think it's quality, mate. I think that was worth the hour long round trip every day of the week. But yeah, we've been busy. Look at all of this. Been taking some crazy photos. Look at that place. So that was in the uh, cloud forest. That was on the skywalk. That's the waterfall. Did a long exposure. The gardens by the bay. That was in the club. That's our pool. And then this is during the race. Got some sparks coming out the back. The Red Bull. So yeah, we've been super busy. Capturing a little bit of the culture here in Singapore. Little India, Chinatown. You know the drill. Oh, look at that shot. This shot actually was, um, this is really difficult to get. So the iPhone perspective could probably get to about that high. So it could only fit this much in the frame. And so we very kindly asked a couple of local guys that had a Samsung. Um, and they've got this function on the phone where you can zoom out. And it gave us the ability to be able to zoom and get the whole frame in. It did make me a little bit skinny and long, but I can deal with that. And uh, yeah, really happy with how this turned out in the end. So this was taken on a phone. Be going up on the gram very soon. But I'm gonna stop rambling on because we need to get changed and ready for this evening's Grand Prix Formula One in Singapore. So we'll catch you guys in five. Crowds come out to watch it on the big screen. Away! Now! Oh, they're pushing hard right now. Oh! He's about to cross the finish line. Sebastian Vettel wins the Singapore 
the race has just finished and we have got Vettel in first place, Leclerc second, both for Ferrari, followed by Verstappen. Hamilton didn't manage to push through, so we've got a Ferrari. Now we're just about to watch the red hot chili peppers perform right on the stage in front of us. It's going to be a good one. What's up everyone? So, excuse me if I'm not in focus, it's hard to tell in this life, but we've just left the Red Hot Chili Peppers concert. What an absolute treat that was. I never ever imagined I'd be able to go to one of their concerts, so that was incredible. So I thought, let's end this video on a high. I just want to say a massive thank you to Singapore Air and Visit Singapore for inviting me along. I've had an incredible time. Can't wait to visit again. If you guys want to find out any information about any of the places that we've been on this trip, I'll leave them in the description box below. Thank you for watching as always. I look forward to seeing you on the next one. Peace.